there everybody, my name is Colin Shadogs, the one but built for theme park news and welcome to a theme park news room update showing you construction uh, for what looks to be footer work or just potential starting groundwork on the extreme spinning coaster at Plopsa Land Pam. Now these updates were from a good friend of the channel called Plopsa Updates on Instagram uh, who's sent construction updates in on in the past. Uh, so make sure you like, comment, subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss this, another YouTube video like this. Uh, make sure you share with your friends, family and on social media and make sure you get your questions in for the q and Use the hashtag question before or after your question. So, let's go on about this construction update then. So I'm going to share some construction pictures on your screen uh, while we talk about some of the stats and details about this coaster for those of you who have no clue about this coaster already. So, on your screen now, Fern Abbey Dorsey, that is the construction update. So, codenamed according to Relicoast Database as Time Traveller. This new Mac Extreme Spinning Coaster is the second one of its kind, of course, behind Time Traveller at Silver Dollar City, which is the prototype coaster. This has a length of 3,018.4 feet, a height of 108.3 feet, a speed of 55.9 miles per hour, five inversions, a heartline roll, a banana roll, a loop, and a zero G roll. Um, you've also got a Time Traveller, which is the project name. It's just a code name at this stage. We don't know the name of it as of yet. Two trains with four cars per train and the riders are arranged two across in two rows for a total of 16 riders per train and it has a reported cost of 15 million euros. Now we've shared loads of stuff about this ride uh, in the past so for those of you who want to check out more stuff uh, about this ride then please, please, please go and check it out um, in the um, Plopsa Parks playlist, I guess, the Studio 100 Parks playlist, uh, where we have all the videos on all the Plopsaland parks, and we are going to be, uh, we're up, well, we are thinking about setting up an individual playlist, of course, for the, um, for the uh, Time Traveller project, shall we say, uh, for this coaster project, as well as a couple of other coasters for 2021 as well. Uh, so, what do I think of this construction then? Well, as you saw on your screen, I think there's some, there's some really good work starting off. I think the cranes on site give me good signs for footer work, groundwork, uh, to officially uh, get underway. Obviously, we know this coast is going to be right near the Super Splash, so uh, maybe there's a good potential opportunity for some interaction with the ride. Uh, so, as you saw by the uh, animated layout. If you haven't gone, if you haven't watched it, please go and watch it because the animated layout looked brilliant um, of what it's set to be. Um, I think there's a real potential for interaction. Maybe, maybe get some interactive elements off ride um, as well. So you can, you can, there's a really good photo opportunity. I think if you can get both the super splash and the the, co the new coaster in the, uh, the same photo, it's a really good photographic opportunity with this ride. Um, so I think from the latest construction, it, we've really started off the ground now. We've really got groundwork officially on the way on this project. Uh, and it's going to be really good to see this construction. I can't wait for months in advance, you know, months down the line for the first track piece to appear on site. You know, that's going to be a joy to watch. Uh, so there we go. So that's the latest construction. There's some statistics on the right for those of you who have no idea about this coaster project. You guys know I'm a massive fan of this project. And I can't wait for the first spinning extreme spinner to come to Europe. So thank you very much. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click the bell so you never miss YouTube video. And for now, guys, keep on the coast life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an awesome day.